Kay Coyne in the circle. That's downstairs, and she walks on a run. That's driven deep to right center field, and it is caught near the wall. A very nice catch by Sydney Coy. It's plenty deep enough to score the run from third. There's her first hit in this game, and it drives in a run. Amy Barre, softball tournament championship. That's a fair ball just inside the line. And we've got a tie game. Trey not trying to do too much with this outside pitch and gets it to land just inside the line. I produced a couple of runs. This ball is tagged deep to left field. Pick her up and kiss that baby goodbye. A three run home run. Four rows deep into the bleachers in left field. That's a group of happy Warhawks. Wow. Noisemaker. Corbello drives a liner to center. It is caught out there by Roberts. The runner tags from third. That scores easily. Corbello hit it hard. Redburn had plenty of time to tag and score from third. Aiden is at second base with two outs. This ball is blasted. Is it fair? Is it foul? Pucker up and kiss that baby goodbye. Lexi Elkins homers yet another time. That's number 18 on the season. Two. Belted deep to left field. You can pick her up and kiss that baby goodbye. Samantha Walsh with the grand slam. Home run in the sixth. Fernandez has walked a couple of times, and this one she belts into right center field. It will roll all the way to the wall. Three Cajun score. And the fleet footed her Fernandez finishes her dash at third. Roll to the left side. The throw from Walsh. Perhaps it's fitting that she makes the final play on the infield. And Barbara Jordan, the final score, Cajuns 14, Warhawks 6, and sets up the top two seeds out of the Sunbelt Conference in the championship game tomorrow.